Welcome back, everybody. Hey there. Uh, check it out. We have an actual pit now. It's, uh, it's frightening. And quite really our insanity is growing. It's alright. Don't worry about it. <laughs> We're messed up individuals, but it's kind of a clever idea because we've realized an exploit in the game for, like, bones and whatnot. Yeah. And we just found it quite fitting to make a pit. Out of the bones, it's it's a uh, it works. Yeah, it's kind of fitting too because we're kind of technically cremating the cannibals. <laughs> what am I using this for? The uh, the wall or the house? Uh, the house for now. All right. Because I'm using that wall there to kind of get through the base. Yeah. Oh yeah, we need a second sled, that's what I was going to do. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. <laughs> Let me try, I'm, I'm like, we can make some kind of entrance. It's just we have to make it cannibal proof. So let's see, let's see. I hate myself for loving you. Where? That is Joan Jett, by the way. Nobody knew. I so, I didn't well. even know, so. <laughs> That's a cool. good song. It's good for the soul. Do you ever feel down and out today? Listen to some Joan Jett. There you go. It's good for the soul. It's literally music for the soul. It's good. <laughs> All right, I'm just chopping down a shit ton of trees, so. Gotcha. And I'm just trying to figure out if we can leave a giant hole in the wall and still be safe. Should be. I'm sure there's something we can do. <laughs> like, ah, I don't know. Like, I'm trying to think of a trap that won't kill us in the process. It shouldn't. I don't, I don't know though. Like, we need a noose trap just so we can attract other people into a happy birthday trap. <laughs> I can build I can build a noose trap here in a moment. I just Yeah. So let's think. Noose traps are kind of a tricky build though. I will say that. Yeah. But if you can lead one person into it, then the others will try and check them out, and then you can lead them in the trap. So it works out. Yeah. I'm trying to think. Ah. I got nothing. I don't know. It's whatever. My attitude about everything. Meh. Meh. Oh yeah, that's why we needed the second sled, so that, like, one person could be constantly, uh, chopping down trees. We have one sled at the site, then one sled full of trees. And then the one per, like, eh, it's a way to describe. <laughs> you already built that second one? No, no, I'm gonna work on it. Oh, I was about to say. I was just trying to explain it, like, you have one that's already full, so the, uh, one person takes that one back while the other one fills up the one that's empty, pretty much. Ah. Yeah. Basically, guys, I'm going to go on a little rant here. Yeah. Um, the forest. Okay, so if you haven't noticed, it's nothing. We can't. There's not much really to say about it. It's pretty straightforward. It's it's blunt. There's yeah. a lot more to it than what we're showing you, and we'll fig you'll figure that out as we build on this yeah. story. Because the thing is, about this game, it's a story that you build for yourself. Literally, you build everything. <laughs> I mean... The actual story is pretty shallow. Find your son. The end. Yeah. <laughs> and is it... And if anything, is it even possible to find if find out if your son's alive? That's the mystery. There's a lot of mystery to this game, and that's yeah. what's really, truly great about it. You don't know. You're just doing it. <laughs> 
You're just kind of surviving. And really, and, and also the thing about our base, if you look off to the coast there, you'll see a crashed boat. That boat had nothing to do with how we got here. Apparently, yeah. that boat has been here since 1982, I think. I have the picture of it. Yeah, it's 82 or 83. It's You guys remember whenever both of us picked up that thing like a couple yeah. episodes back. So really, so really, what this game, what's in so interesting about it is the humanoids, for one, these cannibals, how long have they been here? And clearly, we're not the first ones to be here. Yeah. There are signs that people have been here before us. Like that gravestone, we didn't build that. That was just there, so... It's... Exactly. People have uh, been dying and surviving on this island for years, like... You notice all the skulls and everything that are already just around. Like, those didn't all just come from the the plane, and they didn't just come from the boat, because there's way too many of them, so... Like I said, like he said, people have just been coming and then disappearing on the side of them for so long. Never really combating, we don't know. Yeah. We don't know what happened to them. Maybe but... they are the cannibals, maybe they just... Like, a group got here a while, a while ago and just said, fuck it, let's kill everyone else. So we can get food. Yeah. You don't really know. And that's what's interesting about this game. It's yeah. definitely a lot more different in some aspects to a survival horror. Yeah. I consider it survival horror because, well, it's horrifying to see these fucking things. Like, these fucking creatures. They're terrifying. They really are. Yeah. And like we said, there's they get worse. <laughs> You've oh, only yeah. seen, like, the, the basics. Like, um... I'm not going to spoil the, the the big nasties, but, like, for example, there's just a strong version of the regular guys. Like, he's just covered in black paint, and he just takes a million hits to take down, and he just wipes your ass out. And he's fast. That dude will fuck you up if you give him a chance. Oh, yeah. He will ruin your day. Yeah. And he's just the beginning, like... <laughs> But so far, we haven't advanced ourselves long. Uh, apparently, like, this game adapts to how far you've advanced on the island. Yeah, like, what you've created, how much you've created, how far you've expanded your bases. Like, at some point, we'll probably end up making a second base, like, deep in the forest, just so we have a place to stay. Yeah. Who knows? And so basically, also, we know there's, well, one, the game advances itself. Because, you know, shit will get harder eventually. It's going to get harder for us to survive. But also, it's the fact that um, <laughs> the creatures have been here a long time. Far beyond how long we've been here. Because they know the island better than we do. <laughs> yeah. This is their home. Literally, their whole island is the home. Yeah. And, and also, those big nasties? Well, let's be real here. Generations of in, of you know incest and whatnot. You know they gotta repopulate. Yep. The, so how do you think the big nasties get here? You know, doing the nasty. So, with that Booyah. said, yeah. With that said, <laughs> keep that in mind. <laughs> we're fighting inbreds. <laughs> yep. Pretty much. It's yeah. like uh, what the hills have eyes or some shit like that. Pretty much. There's same gist, pretty much. Yeah. Let's see, let's see. I think I've got an idea. Yeah, this this place is fucking weird. Oh, yeah. The house is looking good. The mansion. Nice. It's looking really good. So, yeah. What I'm really interested in is this game... I will say it's come a long way, and it's definitely worth a try if you haven't played it. And it's been out for quite a while, and I remember when it first came out, and it was buggy as hell, and you could barely play it. Yeah. But I will give it this. The developers are very dedicated to this game. Like, they are they have this game set on a freaking timer to update. Yeah, like, they basically, like, they they haven't missed a date yet, as far as I can tell. Yeah. Like, it's basically as soon as an update comes out, it says, like, time until next update, like, 17 days, 14 hours, 12 seconds, that kind of stuff. And so they hold themselves to it, so. So it's a very, so, with that said, they're a very dedicated team, so you can trust them when it comes to, yes, this is a, 
beta or alpha version. Yeah, I think it's in alpha form now. Yeah. And most people are very cautious, I guess you could say, about early access and whatnot. Yeah. But this one is definitely worth it, the grab because the only way the only way this game's going is up right now. It really is. Yeah. And normal. I'm sorry, turtle. Sorry, you can continue. Oh no, that's all good. I was done. I was just I was basically being this game's Ugh. propaganda. <laughs> yeah. I about had a minor stroke because I thought the tree landed on the sled and I thought I was going to break. <laughs> and But it didn't, thankfully. Huzzah. Also, by the way, yeah. for people who are not, who do watch this, you should also check out. And this is just because I am talking to a awesome person. I won't name her name, but... <laughs> But you should also check out the game Blade Ballet. She and her team at Dream Cells Games are working on it, and you should check it out. It's a pretty cool game. Cool. Yeah. <laughs> I don't even know what it is myself, but that sounds cool. Go for it. It's essentially the thing we've all wanted when it comes to Beyblade. I'll put it like that. Ugh. That sounds cool. It is pretty interesting. Uh, I would have never thought of it. <laughs> we're definitely not going to put... We're uh, On a side note, not recording-wise, we are definitely deleting that part because it sounds like I'm... It sounds like I'm like, uh, yeah. What are you talking about? Personally, it's not a game I would play, but... <laughs> oh, no, we're keeping all this in. I don't edit shit on these episodes. <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> but she watches this shit. I know. Well, she watches my channel, but... We're playing a chill through, man. We don't re we don't edit. If it's not your ish, then it's not your ish. I don't even know why I'm saying ish, but you get the point. <laughs> Alright, good enough. <laughs> hey, nothing against her. If you believe in the project, you believe in it. I do. I do. There you go. I like it. It's cool. It's a neat idea. Just personally, I mean, it's just not my type of game. But yeah. it's other people's types of games, and that's fine. Exactly. Just... Like, um, you know the company Double Fine that made, uh, well, that made a lot of good shit. What am I talking about? They made... Legend. They made, uh, God, I am completely spacing right now. They made Brutal Legend. Yeah, they made Brutal Legend. I, I'm, like, 99% sure they're the ones that made, uh... Ah! It fucking starts with a P. Psychonauts, duh. Yeah. Because uh, I couldn't think of it. But anyways, I believe in a lot of their shit. But there's some things that they do that I'm just like, eh, doesn't look like my kind of thing. So, hey. I believe in them, and I want them to succeed. Because I, oh. I know that fucking... I know that the people over there are awesome. But I don't want to play some of their stuff. <laughs> yeah. That's just how it goes. It looks like Beyblade to me. Yeah, it's what I was saying, and it does look kind of cool. Like, uh, they've been working on it for quite a while, so cool. So that's just my little spiel on that subject. I'm just trying to offer you know some help because I know what it's like to you know be starting up, working on shit. You know, hell, we're still starting up. <laughs> yeah, we're still starting up ourselves, and maybe one day. Yeah, if we're lucky, thirty people will see this video. And that's then, that's wishful thinking right there. I agree. I have <laughs> high hopes that after the military, I can actually start like a music career or something. Yeah. Get started in video games or whatever. But anything's possible. Yeah. Just go for I'm it. just I'm just now starting. Right now, I actually do have a goal, and that is when it comes to my YouTube channel, <coughs> Six Sun C X X X. <laughs> oh yeah. I don't, I don't know if that was a misspelling or if you just like, ah, whatever. It's a misspelling, but I kind of just kind of rolled with it. You can you can fix it any time, though. I know, but... <laughs> yeah. It's all good. But you guys know the channel. He promotes us, we'll promote him. Yeah. Oh, shit. I oh, the no. log would break. Anyways, yeah. Did you know that if you get 100,000 subscribers on YouTube... 
they send you a silver, it's like a silver YouTube play button. Cool. It's like a little, it comes in like a little frame, and it looks so awesome, and you, and it's like the CEO of... Oh, shit. <laughs> it's like the, sorry, what were you saying? Uh, the CEO of YouTube, they, she like sends it to you, apparently it's a she, from what I've heard. Oh. Jesus Christ, get the fuck off me. That's cool. <laughs> And that's my goal, is to one day receive one of those. Yeah. Like, 100,000 subscribers, that would make my life. Exactly. I'm still <laughs> happy that, like... Well, I guess it's when we're lucky. Like, if I'm bothering the shit out of people on Facebook, like, Hey, watch this, please! You know. Trying to become world famous. Yeah. With the... Uh, I'm sure, one day, we just... We gotta promote ourselves. That's... That's it. <laughs> We will. One you day. gotta be shameless sometimes. Just be like, watch my shit. Hey, yeah. shove it in their faces. Only maybe not that, but you get what I mean. <laughs> Some people do it. Others. Yeah. I've got one bomb left. I'm gonna throw it over here. Oh shit. Shit's about to get real. Oh, this one's gonna be big. Oh, ooh, that was a big one. I missed it. Oh my god, all the trees are falling. They look fine from here, let's see them all disappear when we get over there. I just chopped down like 10 trees at once. And... I just fucked up nature. <laughs> well, they all look fine to me, but that, oh, that's why. Yeah. <laughs> I can only see the tree line and like, everything seems completely normal, and then I go back, and then I go inside and like, everything's down. <laughs> and Tyler was here. <laughs> Oh well, boy. Sorry, nature, but it had to be done. If you don't understand, we need to make a wall and a nice house. Notice how much work we've accomplished just by chopping down trees and doing this system. Yeah. And we've been on this island, I don't even know how many days. It's been a while. Yeah. Actually, it keeps a counter of how long you've survived. Yeah. Oh yeah, if you're in single player, you get like two chances to survive, really. Like, if you die once, or if you, you if you get basically knocked down once, then uh, the cannibals like drag you into a cave or whatever. Something like and that. And then you have a chance to escape and get out of there, but if you die before you leave, or if you die within like two days of when you died, then the game's over. But you get a chance to survive. Which is nice. Yeah. All right, the fir first floor of the house is complete. Nice. Let's get this wall done. Let's see if we can do it by the end of the day. And it's already nightfall. So time's ticking. The problem is I can still get through this entrance, but I want to. I need to figure it out. I know we can put something at the end of this that won't kill us, but will kill them. Maybe a fire, like a something. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know either. Are those new slacks? What? It's like that old people porn. Remember oh, that? Oh yeah. Like, Are those new slacks? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know why I got reminded of that. I don't. Jesus <laughs> Christ! I I need to f fix my life. Oh, by the way, the reason why I was late, I forgot to tell you. I got distracted was because we got pulled over on our way back. Oh boy, what happened? Uh, apparently our taillights were broken. Huh. That's pretty important. Yeah, it was pretty important. We fucked that up. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, time to start chopping up some new meals. Because they're starting to run out of food here. That's one. The hero of our story, folks. Chopping up bodies and eating them. What was that? Oh, are you putting bodies in the pit? Oh, I, I'm chopping up bodies in the pit right now. Look at that. What am I missing? You see those lights off in the distance over there? Hold on. Give me a sec. Look where I'm standing. Hold on. One more. There we go. Alright, what am I doing? It's gone. Oh. Oh, maybe it was the sun going down, but there were lights off in the distance, and mm. 
It just looked interesting. I was like, oh, how majestic. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Well, we still have one giant hole in our wall, but at least we're halfway. We're about, uh, three quarters of the way protected. Yeah. Yeah. I still want to finish this tower over here. Huh. Among, like, everything else. Like, we're still making a mansion. We're still, like, making the camp look nice. We're still making shelter and storage. Hey, a turtle. I'm not going to kill you because I don't need your shell. You can live, Mr. Whatever. Can we capture the turtle? Kind of, but not really. Like, the moment that we leave the game, he'll get out of it anyway. Uh, <laughs> I know yeah. you can capture rabbits, because they have this little, like, like, uh, thing that you can, like, capture and then breed them in. Yeah, rabbit cage. Store, store live rabbits and watch them multiply. So the question is, how the hell do you get them in there? I never figured that part out. I don't know. Never made it that far. Yeah. Like, I know I put one out in the woods once, but it didn't do anything. Huh. So I need to figure out how the hell to make it do the thing. <laughs> <laughs> do the thing. Do the thing. Get in there. Uh, oh, animal trap. That that would probably do it. But then again, nothing ever got caught into my animal trap, so I don't know. <gasps> I don't know either. You got me. Deadpool, by the way. It's quite oh, yeah. There's a little bit of space between this episode and the last one. He got to go see the movie. Yes. <laughs> it was quite magical. <laughs> Definitely the funniest movie I've seen all year. Nice. It's one of my favorite superhero movies. Or, well, super thing movies. He doesn't want to call himself a hero. Yeah. <laughs> Where is... Just walking around in complete darkness here. Damn it. I need a better way to find my lights. Mm. Yeah. Uh, 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 is it all the way up here? Uh, no, no, I went too far. Did it break? What's the what? point of having standing lights if they bur- if they burn down? What are you talking about? I had a standing light out here, and it's gone now. That sucks. What's the point of them? <laughs> no idea. Like, the only ones that don't really do anything or go away are the skull lanterns, but they don't give off too much light. Oh, hi there, buddy. Hey, come here real quick, Tyler. Hold up. We got a visitor just kind of chilling in the middle of camp. <laughs> oh, hi. Yeah, he isn't. He's just sitting here. He's watching me, but he's not getting up. Is he, like, worshipping us, or is he just, like... He has come to realize that we are... The Alphas. He doesn't seem to care that we're close to him. Is it glitched, or...? I don't know. This is kind of creepy. He hasn't done anything. So he isn't look. making any angry noises. Oh, you can push him. There you go, just get him, get him, get him out of here. <laughs> this is a... He's come to offer us the royal blowjob. <laughs> With his pointy-ass teeth. Ugh. Wow, these things are really creepy up close. <laughs> I know. I don't know what hit. Well, I don't know what his deal is. I'm assuming he's glitched, but you got me. So, uh, what are we gonna call you? You decided to come here on our on the day of our non-existent daughter's wedding. Yeah. And well, he's uh, got a bunch of CDs around his neck. Let's call him DJ something. What, do you what kind of DJ? Yeah, what kind of DJ are you? <laughs> Depends. Does he like EDM or country or? Oh, my got a friend. Are you? Have you come to worship us too? Yes. I hope so. Have you come? come join the celebrations. Have you come to worship the royal flesh flute? <laughs> come with me. DJ McSkullite, uh, the most creative name ever. DJ McSkullite. Whoa! He nodded at me. He agrees with DJ Skullite. DJ Skullite, it is. Greetings, he- DJ Skullite. Hello, sir. 
<laughs> My friend, DJ Skullite, you have been permitted permission to live amongst us. Huzzah! Welcome to the clan. You must now endure the royal, uh, uh, Come on, buddy. Come stoning. on. The royal what? The royal stoning. <laughs> there you go. You have now been knighted. Huzzah! 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 I'm waiting for this guy to try and charge us so he runs into the fire. Now. Eh. We must begin the initiation. What is this initiation? I don't really know. More uh, stoning. You must sit there and not move much. And guard these sticks. <laughs> <laughs> you must guard the sticks with your life, DJ Skullite. I shall add more. Huzzah. DJ Skullite, you now also provide us with the Skullite from your magical, majestic Skullite. Huzzah. <laughs> we offer you our powerful wisdom, and you offer us in return. Daylight. Daylight, it is. <laughs> Huzzah. Huzzah. Now perform your sacred duty and shine your light over here. Ah, oh, that was me. Welcome, <laughs> DJ Skullite. <Now. laughs> I really hope he just stays there and chills with us. Like, I hope he doesn't randomly decide to be, like, an asshole in the middle of the day. <laughs> if we could just, like, lock him in a cage and make him our spotlight, that would be <laughs> sick. Dude, that would be... We have our own fucking DJ skull light. I know. Hold on. Let's let's do it real quick. Let me, uh... I'm not gonna do a... I'm not gonna do a bone wall, because this guy's chilling. Let's make him a stick fence. All for his own. Here, let's, le let's just leave him like that, honestly. Let's not put him... <laughs> Alright, alright. DJ Skullite has come here on peaceful terms and is granted the permission of not to be trapped. His friend, however, He's seems an asshole. hostile. <laughs> let's DJ make him hop over the fence to his own doom. You get away from our special guest, DJ... Whoa, whoa, whoa. Careful. Get over here and see if he... Uh... Decides to become one with the fire. DJ Skullite, shine your magical, mythical light on your once brother. <laughs> he doesn't seem to give a shit that his friends are dying, so that's cool. This is a test for you, Skullite. Behold, as your comrade is... He, he doesn't care at all. I like this guy. Now, DJ Skullite, <laughs> feast upon your brother. Huzzah! 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 <laughs> All hail, DJ Skullite. <laughs> hail! Hail! Wow, this episode took a turn for the most interesting. Hey look, another DJ, uh, another... No, he's not a DJ, he's just a Skullite. Now, DJ Skullite, you must shine your light upon thine heathen, who is running around with notes pop on. What a jackass. Point her out to me, <gasps> DJ Skullite. Oh shit! <laughs> I didn't expect him to hop on me. Come on, bruh. Come on. Come on, hop the fence. It is your destiny. DJ Skullet, it seems your brothers and sisters have come to reclaim you. Ah. I wonder if he's, like, mourning or something. I want to know what he's doing. I don't know. Like, I know sometimes they're sad whenever whenever you, like, put up their friends' skulls or whatever. Oh, shit. I'm almost dead. I'm gonna go inside. Ah! Man. You guys are freaking crazy. DJ Skullite, we are about to offer up a room, a royal ceremony, one that we uphold every night, following the Grand Purge. We, so we burn these motherfuckers to the ground. Essentially, Alrighty. but that would be a broad, blunt term. <laughs> to put it bluntly, we burn your brothers and sisters. Yep. And. Uh, Pray First that. time with an actual pit. <laughs> God damn, these guys are- holy shit! Oh, shit! I think we need to pull out the big guns. 
or at least the fiery guns. The DJ Skull Life. <laughs> I know. We, we have to avoid hitting him. It will be a challenge. I killed three already. <laughs> Make that four. Oh, yay, one jumped in the pit. One oh, has oh, he sec survived. I've just been sitting here with a Molotov in my hands while you've been taking care of all of them. DJ Skullite, offer us wisdom. Yeah. Your brothers and sisters to put down their arms, for they will not be harmed if they join our side and become our royal spotlights. Indeed. <laughs> we are burning the infants of your clan. Why am I talking like this? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I just kind of started and just rolled with it. Uh, it's kind of it's kind of nice. It's kind of interesting, actually. Yeah, it's fun. <laughs> People, you see what this game does to me? <laughs> oh, did another one hop in the fire? Oh, a That's... seagull. Huh. <laughs> Whoa. Okay, I'm up here now. Ah, daylight oh, no. is coming. Indeed. Is one of them still alive? Oh no, DJ Skullite. DJ Skullite. He ran away! Traitor! Traitor! Yeah, I guess it was just a nighttime thing. Like, I heard him making random noises. That isn't him. That's some other dude. That That's the one that got burned up in the fire. So DJ Skullite must have already run off. DJ Skullite was a sheep. Was a fucking wolf in sheep's clothing. Yeah. This is just... There's DJ Skullite. How's it going, bro? I thought you were with us, my friend. You have a chance to leave. No! Traitor! Finish him! This is what you'll get for being a spotlight and then not being a spotlight. Get fucked. Get fucked. <laughs> we shall offer you a warrior's uh, burning. Yes, bring him to the pit. Bring him to the pit. <laughs> You know what? Let's make him a special case. Your head... Uh... Shall be chopped off. Forthwith! <laughs> and shall remain in my inventory until I figure out what to do with you. Huzzah! Huzzah! <laughs> Meanwhile, the survivor of the fire is dead. <laughs> now, this one we bring to the pit. Yeah, fuck that guy. Alright, allow me to do the ceremonial burning. Alright, I want to be part of this though. This is a special occasion. We right, have I'll, I'll take the right side and the back and you take the left. Yeah! Did I miss? What the fuck? Oh, I didn't light it on fire. I forgot to light the goddamn Molotov. Alright, hold on. We don't throw it just yet. I'll tell you when. Okay. Well, I just wasted one anyway, so... We gather here today to put rest to the evil spirits on this land. <laughs> and we're here to make a sign. This is a ritual to purge the evil from this land and bring justice and unity to the island. Huzzah! Huzzah! Throw the fire. Whoosh. Amazing grace. How sweet the sound. <laughs> I don't know the rest of it. Oh, I kind of do, but I'm not. By the way, goodbye, DJ Skullite. You were remembered and then quickly became an asshole with the Remember. others. Remembered, <laughs> then dismembered. Remembered and then dismembered. DJ <laughs> Skull. You were one of the greats. Is that his head rolling around? Where? Right here. Is this DJ Skullite's head? Uh oh oh Jesus. Is he like he's like one of the only ones that didn't turn into a bunch of skull oh wait, never mind. No, oh, he already did. <laughs> DJ Skullite, am I holding his head? Uh, no, I am. I don't even know where that one came from. It was just rolling around on the ground. 
<laughs> that was definitely the best moment we've had in this game. So oh boy. <laughs> was the burning of all the people. <laughs> and just breaking down into amazing. <laughs> <laughs> oh boy. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> Why did we do that? I don't know. Let's have a special marker for him. This is DJ Skullite's head. So he shall have a special place in the back of the in the back of the pit. Yes. I love that the bodies have been here quite a while to the point that you can, the burning of the bodies have made the flies pull up here. <laughs> oh, I thought I'd put a head on there, but whatever. Alright, there you go. There's a burning effigy to DJ Skullite. <laughs> Who became one with us for one night to be our royal spotlight. Indeed. And then quickly remembered and dismembered. <laughs> Rest in pasta, friend. Rest in pasta. <laughs> I think I fucked up making the effigy. Nah, it'll be all right. Let all right, that, now that we've done finished that, it's back to work. Yep. Oh, there we go. I figured it out, kind of. Although I still fucked it up. Nice, dude. That looks badass as fuck. <laughs> Just don't look at it from the D side. It's fine. DJ Skull. <laughs> That's badass. He will now forever light up the pit with his sick. <laughs> there you go. Those killer jams that... Oh no! His new mixtape is fire! Oh god. <laughs> yeah, no, nobody comes over anymore. <laughs> that was the last man, and there he is. <laughs> Jesus. DJ Skullite. Jesus. <laughs> That's gonna be the name of this episode because we've said it like fifty times. <laughs> Jesus Christ! <laughs> oh boy! Not even God could save you, DJ. <laughs> <laughs> Remember and dismembered. <laughs> I fucking love it. That needs to be his gravestone title, like right now. <laughs> oh boy! If we can make one, then we'll definitely. Let me see. I'm, I'm gonna look. I know we can make creepy ass effigies out of like anything we can find, but <laughs> which is kind of which is kind of weird, but yeah. Oh, we could have made him a decorative skull. Ah, nah, nah, never mind. <laughs> nah, that wouldn't have been as fun. Yeah. We literally have his head on fire on a stick. There's nothing more brutal than that. Yeah. Fair enough. <laughs> Dude, their their attacks are building up. Yeah, last night was fucking crazy. Like, I think they, they're they finally getting tired of us. They really want us dead. Yeah. So we need to finish this wall, like, today. Yeah. Oh, shit, I forgot <laughs> to bring the sled out. Damn it. That's fine, I have one out here already. Yeah. Just, uh, actually, go back to the wall real quick. Like, I'll, I'll focus on cutting down trees. Just, uh, start putting down some traps along the wall. Or something. We need, we need something at the entrance. Like... Figure out something that won't kill us, but will kill them. That we can, like, go over without having to worry about. I'm sure there's one like that. What, like a trap? Yeah. Like something that we can go through, but they can't. <laughs> oh, by the way, this is off subject. Maybe you can cut this out. Are you, are you going to edit this at all? Nah, probably not. <laughs> you can just uh, okay. go ahead and say it. I was gonna say, if you do, you need to have, like, while his head's on fire and shit, just, like, have, like, dubstep and, like, the shaky camera and, like, oh, the no. shit. <laughs> and, like, some crazy dubstep music. Wah, wah, wah. I'll probably do a little snap back to that. Shit. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, we're having way too much fun with that guy. I that, hope we have more followers like him in the future. God, I hope. <coughs> that builds so much backstory. <laughs> oh, yeah. That makes this so much more real.
That's fucking awesome. Dude, his head's still on fire. That's so fucking brutal. Awesome. I just hope that he doesn't turn into a skull or some shit. It shouldn't, dude. I hope. I hope his head just stays there. Me too. Well, that was the first time I made a custom effigy, so I had no idea what I was doing, so I'm glad it worked out. It looks awesome. It's kind of hilarious, too, because his mixtape was badass, so... <laughs> it literally was fire, now he's fire, and it just worked out. It's just the circle of life, man. It's the beautiful. <laughs> Live by the fire, die by it, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. Said so we kind of chopped off his head and shit. Ah, whatever. That that didn't come into plan, but it <laughs> kind of happened that way. It's a circle of life. <laughs> oh, man. Uh, I think we've outdone ourselves today, folks. Yes, today has definitely been the most eventful. <laughs> God, I hope we get more like that. I know, me too. <coughs> it's been a while since I've laughed so hard it fucking hurt my voice. <coughs> or maybe. Oh, God damn it. Ah, this is gonna be a little while, isn't it? <coughs> we just got 60 <laughs> logs to chop down, I don't know. Oh boy. Oh my god, you brought this thing all the way on the water, didn't you? Yeah, I don't want them to like run past it somehow, so I was making sure. Like, I don't think they can swim as far as I can tell, so. I, I guess I, I, put, I made it out like just far enough to where to go around it you have to swim. Oh, okay. Yeah. I've got a, uh, whoa. Where'd all the logs go? I've oh, been cheated! I just cut down a tree and I got zero logs out of it. HA! <laughs> okay, DJ Skullite's revenge. <coughs> so DJ Skullite. <coughs> oh man. Do not pass go, do not collect $200. Do not collect 51 logs. <coughs> Oh boy. <laughs> <coughs> Rest in pasta, sweet prince. We hardly knew ye. We hardly knew ye. <laughs> <coughs> I need to start making use of this bow and arrow. Like, I want to figure out if I can... God damn it. Light him on fire or not. <coughs> you can. I think. I hope so. I mean, I know I used to be able to, and that was like the best shit ever. Because lighting people on fire is like the ultimate weapon. Fire. Fire. The next fire, fire is uh, DJ Mixtapes. Or, damn it. DJ Skullite's Mixtapes. <laughs> Yeah, you know all those, like, cassette tapes we find on the island? Oh, yeah. Those aren't even, like, audio clips, <laughs> they're just DJ <laughs> skull like, like. And because he's, like, a mindless, uh, because he's a mindless cannibal, like, all of the de all the mixtapes are just, like, <laughs> shit like that. So, like, basic Skrillex. <laughs> there you go. Good God. <laughs> <laughs> DJ Skull like killing it. <laughs> Hashtag savage. Hashtag <laughs> savage. Wait, are we the hashtag savage ones this time around for fucking destroying him, or is he the savage one in this situation? He was the traitor. Yeah. He betrayed our holy cause right when we we were about to make him a royal feast out of his brothers and sisters. I know. He could have eaten for days, given how many fucking assaulted us last night. We killed all of them. Then he proceeded to run away and attack us. Yeah, I, I was gonna give him a chance if he just ran away, but no, he had to swing at us. He had to swing, and that's when we had to put him down. <laughs> oh, it's boy. Tough, li tough living these wastelands, man. Exactly. You live by the fire, you die by the fire. That's just the way it works. This is the way it works, man. <laughs> Alright, folks at home, we've had plenty of fun, but now it's time to say goodbye and Mr. Rogers' neighbor. I don't fucking know. <laughs> <laughs>
I haven't seen that show in so long, I don't remember how to leave. Either way, we'll see you next time. Alrighty? Bye. Alright, bye-bye. Bye. -bye. bye. <laughs>